Good day, my name is Lloyd Wenog, and today I will be discussing the different exception to hearsay rules or hearsay evidence. Thank you. The first exception is it must be the dying declaration or anti-mortem statement. To be admissible, a dying declaration must refer to the cause and circumstances surrounding the declarant's death. Second is, be made under consciousness of an impending death. Third, be made freely and voluntarily without coercion or suggestion of improper influence. Fourth is, be offered in a criminal case in which the death of the declarant is the subject on inquiry. Lastly, is have been, have been made by a declarant competent to testify as a witness had that person been called to testify. The second exception is the declaration is against interest. So, what it is it is the declarant is dead or unable to testify. Second, the declaration relates to a fact against the interest of the declarant. Third, at the time he made the declaration, the declarant was aware that the same was contrary to his aforesaid interest and the declarant had no motive to falsify and believe such declaration to be true. For the third exception is the declaration against pedigree. The declarant is dead or unable to testify. The declaration relates to the pedigree of another person. The declarant is are related by birth or by marriage to the person whose pedigree is in question and such relationship is shown by evidence other than such act or declaration and the act or declaration was made prior to the controversy these are the word included in the word pedigree first is relationship family genealogy birth marriage uh, death the dates when the places where these facts occurred, the names of the relatives, and the facts of family history intimately connected with pedigree. For the fourth exception, is it has to be common reputation. Uh, the reputation refers to a matter of public or general interest more than 30 years old. Uh, marriage or moral character uh, second is the reputation or tradition was formed before the controversy. Third, the reputation is one formed in the community. For the last exception to hearsay rules, it's, it has to be parts of the res geste. Parts of res rule is statement made by a person while a startling occurrence is taking place or immediately prior or subsequent thereto with respect to the circumstances thereof may be given in evidence as part of res geste. Types of part of res geste. Spontaneous exclamation. And second, statement accompanying an unequivocal act. 